Well, some say it's the best beer in, beer in Vermont. Um, Alchemist, this is a heady topper. They also have a focal banger. Wait, it's not the great beer in Vermont. It's comedians opening cards, no coffee. Comedians. Like, Yo, that's so creepy. So you ever seen them without their mask on? Well, it's okay. Like I said, Norman freaking ate ah, it, and then oh, uh, it's like it's uncircumcised. Uh, yeah. That's them without their mask on, by the way. Oh yeah. wow! I feel like you're seeing it. Like, like you I don't, said, it's, it's like a like turtle without a shell. Oh I don't like God. it. Yeah, that's a naughty card. It's like making a naughty card. Yeah, right. It's Winnie the Pooh with no shirt. Next time, turtles. Wow, the turtle ones are fun. They like steal their cum. I'm not sure. That white, uh... That's, not the turtle. Well, that's just sweat. No. Turtle sweat? It's just turtle sweat. Her oh, yeah, the mask. Turtle wax. Oh, Fuck, yeah. that was the check out Dream Girl Chrissy. She was Ooh. awesome. Ooh. Huh? Ooh. Three's coming. You know, they me. switched her with a different girl. Yeah, because because her husband was asking for more money. Oh, and really? then with the contract, and then they didn't think they would get rid of her. Sticker. And then the episode that she left, like for that season, yeah. she was like on the phone. They did a fo whole phone thing where she wasn't oh, there. It was whoa. so whack. Because yeah. I remember watching at the time going, what's going on? There was a new Chrissy, right? Yes, they brought a new person and in. It was Susan, uh, what's her name? Susan Summers was Susan Summers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Was and she did the thigh master and all yeah, that yeah. stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Part of like is, a, is there a more like collectible that? thing? Because this is just part of an image. We've well, just got a lot of crotch sniffing right if you, here. If you I get, need to see what the rest of it is. Yeah, you've got to get all of the before. cards to make another. Hey, you can come in and do some cards. Rude, You're a comedian, rude. right? Wait, what? It's, we're just doing a thing. It's, it's all fun. It's filming us. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't. It's, it's all good. It's porn. It's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, know, you can keep your clothes on. The stickers really slow. Yeah, there's fun. I mean, there's like. Uh, it's kind of cool. All right. Well, it's okay. And you didn't even open them yet. I, oh yeah. Um, open your terrace. I, I uh, because I'm an Arab, right? So <laughs> I, I, I picked right. the. The terrorist attack one, so let's, it says educational cards. Sure. About okay. America fighting back, which is not true because they always just fight for nothing. But let's see, they say educational, so let's see if they are actually. But, okay, that's not, that's not a terrorist attack, okay. Well, he's just drowning. It's just, just, just a guy choking, that's not a fucking terrorist attack. It's terror. It? Well, maybe, it's maybe terror we're attack. waterboarding him. <laughs> we're that's attacking crazy, him. Dude. We're like poison gas, gas. attack. Like poison. Yeah, that's mustard gas. Oh, look, it's Yasser Arafat, the former president of Palestine, right? <laughs> Which is where I'm from. Right? <laughs> Many people thought this was pussy. It's actually Palestine. <laughs> it looks like New Jersey. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was like Tiger Woods' new. Yeah, I thought it was like a new shoe ad logo. <laughs> yeah. What the? I don't know. Is, there, is, is that Saddam Any Bosnian? No, it's, it's, no. it's Al Qaddafi. This is Al Qaddafi. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, an interesting fact: the first, the first bullet they shot him, like when they did the revolution, was in his penis. Oh, Jesus! They wanted to really take him out. There is that check oh, checklist. Oh, the checklist is uh, sometimes uh, the most that's, valuable that's, card oh, yeah, because yeah. the kids didn't want them, and they would then check on them, and okay. so you get the, get the ones that don't have the checks. There, you know. Had their card checklist. Mad Dog Qaddafi. Okay, I think I have the Qaddafi one. Yeah, yeah, and then you mark it down, and then you know you collect them all. Oh, I do have the Qaddafi one. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Qaddafi he's, gets he's his. Fighting him. We're really going after him. Oh my God. How long have you been doing stand up? Uh, I've been doing it for like two years now. Nice. Um, and it's a I, great venue. Yeah. It, it is. It's you so never, look, look at this one. It's, it says making a bomb. That's every time Sandy performs in it. Ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> so I'll just check it, I, I guess. I feel like that's going to be the clip. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll get something out of there. That's Sick. all good. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Awesome. Well, you guys, super cool, and uh, you know, keep uh, doing your stand-up because, uh, and hey, go see live stand-up because that's the only way to really see it. But uh, hey, rock and roll, uh, Vermont. Hey. Fun, hey. fun times. God bless, man. Yeah. Thank you. Right. Super cool. Thank you so much. Shabbat shalom. Sorry. Yeah. Just some stuff. <laughs> All right, time's going. Uh, good evening. 
My name is David Bacon. <laughs> and yeah, everything is better with me. <laughs> Thanks for asking. Ladies. <laughs> Gentlemen. <laughs> everything. <laughs> Embarrassingly, I'm still learning to read, so I'm going to be practicing tonight with this little notepad. <laughs> Teacher, be proud! <laughs> My three minutes tonight might be uh, too meta for this young crowd. Uh, I mean Metamucil. <laughs> I want to start by addressing the obvious elephant in the room, at least to me. This thing. Comedy tech sucks. What year is this? This is stupid. <laughs> That's not a rhetorical question. I was struck in the head with an acne anvil on the way over here. <laughs> is that too cartoonish? What year is this, 2023? Thanks for that participation. <laughs> so we are almost a quarter of the way into the 21st century with some fun new inventions. Not all good. Still this crappy mic. We kind of have self-driving cars. Uh, but if you put a traffic cone on their hood, they play dead like uh, hedgehog. <laughs> We're getting scarier and scarier robot dogs. You can mount guns on them now, so they're becoming both cops and robbers. <laughs> I can't wait to play deadly games with the kids. Red Rover, Red Rover, stay the F away. <laughs> but even though comedy is in the biggest boom ever, give, and take, give or take the 1980s, what the fudge? <laughs> Why does every comedy club still use Buddy Holly's original microphone and crappy speakers? What is this, vaudeville? Should I do Song of the South? Those examples are antiquated antiquities. Uh, get it? This mic sucks. This seems so easily solved. Uh, I'm sure everyone is. Shit, I did the tour. I'm sure everyone has seen a TED Talk or a singer at a stadium show. They use this headpiece thingy with a microphone so your hands are free to move about the cabin and act out. I'm an airplane. I don't care if you don't laugh. <laughs> no, let me keep my hand right here, always this close to my face, miming I have a complete ice cream cone but won't enjoy any of it. Like, not only am I participating in, but also winning some sort of updated Stanford Marshmallow experiment. Hey, here we are at the original site of Rhodes Tavern, where the first election was here in D.C. Um, it seems like an appropriate uh, spot to uh, have uh, introduce, introduce, I'm not introducing, you're going to see Shane Gillis on Comedians Opening Cards No Coffee. Uh, there's no reason why I would pick the site of this tavern to uh, have the Shane Gillis episode. Uh, maybe we can get an earlier, we can another drinker for the early part. And uh, I love this little thing because here's where, uh, check out this little picture here of the uh, burning of the thing. Hey, it's a great episode, so check it out and tune in and like and subscribe and tune in every week. And uh, it drops before Kill Tony, so it's uh, a fun day Monday. Uh, comedians opening cards, getting coffee. All right. And we got Shane Gillis, who's the best. Okay, so here's a bunch of cards. Uh, you can pick something and open it and tell me why you picked that one. Oh, and then I see. there's Moon, and then we'll, we'll open them up and see what they Ooh. are. And then, you know, Mark ate the gum. <laughs> and I'm like, how's the Gremlins? gum? He's like, not good. I'm going Gremlins. Gremlins. So why do you pick Gremlins? I don't know. I loved it. It was a great, <laughs> was was a a great movie. I love it. Steven yeah. Spielberg presents Gremlins. <laughs> Billy Pelser has a nice home. <laughs> Billy, is that you? Yeah, Ma, it's me. A nice job. A nice girl. If you're not doing anything this Thursday night, maybe you'd like to uh, go out on a date with me? I'd love to. And loving parents who are about to give him... You're gonna like this. No, 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 don't shake it. We're gonna have to open it now. We'll wait till Christmas. The most unusual gift he ever got. What is it? It's your new pet. Come on, Barney, be a good dog. My dad gave it to me. But there are a few things to keep in mind. If you expose it to the light, you may hurt it. If you get it wet, it will multiply. All that from water? We got wet? Yeah, plain water. And most important, no matter how much they beg, 
never, never let them eat after midnight. Because when they do, they change. They become clever. Mischievous. What's going on here? And dangerous. Someone's, huh? Little monsters. Right. Hundreds of them. Well, I, I don't know, maybe thousands. Things. Where do they come from? Look, I know it sounds crazy. I know. But in a few hours, you're going to have a major disaster on your hands. <laughs> Grandmas, directed by Joe Dante. They'll be expecting you. Don't drink. Don't drink. The, what was the three things? It was yeah. after midnight. Well, I didn't love it that much. Fuck. Oh, I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Nice. I got gizmo. Oh, right off the bat. Let's go. Gizmo rookie card. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Usually the lower the number, the harder. Like, number one's always the hardest one to get. The guy getting attacked by a gremlin from the roof. Ooh. <laughs> Could have been 9-11 answer. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Another gizmo. Wow. He was That's the popular one. Back-to-back -back gizmo. Oh, there's, there's almost two on there. Yeah. yeah Probably drinking Yo. water or something after... Oh, that's the bad. Animal, vegetable, gremlin. Let's go. <laughs> He's kind of scary. Big Don. Reminds me of my ex. Who's <laughs> uh, Jordan Peterson. That's big. <laughs> uh, this guy's in trouble again in a burning building. Little 9-11. Oh, my gosh. Wow, you got a lot of cards. You got the more than a lot of cards. The original party animal. Let's go. It's Bert Kreischer? <laughs> yeah. I gotta get that, episode, that uh, Life magazine. There's ladies stuck in what appears to be jizz. Ooh. That's a, that's a tough card to that's get. That's a tough jizz. Wait, maybe this was already opened. <laughs> <laughs> and again, uh, somebody spraying bikes with a hose. So that's a good card. That's, that's from the 60s, then, I think. There we go. George Zimbabwe. We got George Zimbabwe. Oh, wow. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Puzzle back. There's a puzzle oh, back yeah. too. Yeah, what yeah. What do you mean? No, look, you, oh, like if you, you put them together or something and make a puzzle, if you get like eight or twelve That's or sixteen awesome. or something. And he ate yeah, the yeah. gum. Yeah, he ate the gum. Which is crazy. Yeah, yeah, I know. I couldn't believe. Oh, they got the gum. This yeah, is yeah. Like Eighty-year-old gum here. Yeah, yeah. Can I grab one too? Can I do? This of course. You can. Can. How's there the gum? Go, baby, look Not at that. Good. Do you want no. to keep them? Yeah, definitely. Awesome, man. Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah. Will you sign one and give it to me? Yeah, for sure. Or write something or whatever? Good, That'd be good. good. Wait, uh, give me the Jordan Peterson one. All right. Or whatever. Whichever one. All right. Rockstar status. Sorry yeah, to yeah. keep you waiting. No, you're good, man. What, what time's the last set? What time? You're... you're like, you won't be... 10, 30? You, will you be around? Because I have... I, I, um, so we got that's, three more. You won't... Will you... Like, that shows a 10... Or I'm going to see Avalucci. Oh, okay. When I come back here, because I have something super special to do right. episode two, if you're around. All right. But I'll just give Maybe. you a peek. I'll give you a peek, though. Ooh. It's World War II cards, and there are possibly Nazi flags. They're crazy, but I don't know what's inside. That'd be awesome. So I don't know if you're around, though. All right. I should be. I should All right. be around. So I'll, I'll come back after that one and hang out. Awesome. Thanks, Shane. Thanks. Good to see you. Whoa, season one is now over. You just saw the Gillis one. Before that, I hope you watched the Bean Eaten with Jordan Jensen. Uh, that's Ian Fidance. That was with uh, Ron and Hershberg and uh, Simeon Goodson also. Before that, we had Norman and Morrill. Great. Then we had List, Patton, and Myers. We had Okerson, and we had Mattern. I mean, that was season one. Sorry. Uh, you know, go see stand-up comedy live. It's the best time right now. Uh... You don't even have to see the freaking big boys. Uh, you don't even have to see these big boys. Just go freaking see live comedy. It's totally worth it. Yeah, it's a great time. But for season two so far, we've got uh, Will Solvance. Uh, he's been doing it a long time. He's a freaking stud. Uh, first of all, there are no black oh. cards here. Well, uh, shoot. I'm sorry about that's a good call. Because uh, I'm into uh, robotics, and Night Rider was like a robot, all the more the robot. Uh, Aaron Berg, oh my god, no one 
funnier, faster. You think Okerson is quick on his feet in the doing crowd work? Freaking Berg just destroys. Hey, how are you? We're, there's a building back there. I'm very excited to do this. I'm already looking at the cards that you have, thinking about my choice, and it's not going to be an easy choice, I'm going to tell you that. Yeah. Okerson is amazing. Don't, uh, that wasn't what I was saying. Uh, Al Lubell, old timer, won, um, uh, he won some show back in the day, uh, Star Search. Uh, and, uh, you know, he's a f uh, law kind of guy. 20 minutes he gave me. It's it's classic Alu Bell. If you like Alu Bell, if you love Alu Bell, th that episode will be for you. Uh, Rocky for Russia's Mightiest Man. I have questions with that. That's hyperbole. <laughs> right? We don't know how many. First, he's a fictional character. And second of all, even if we just go by him as a, he looks very strong, but there's for a second, he's not even Russian in real life. Okay, we got to go by the fiction. So he's playing, and as a fictional thing, they could say what the hell they want. It's fiction. So I guess it's true within the concept of this fictional story. But on the other hand, you could argue that maybe it isn't true. That's that fictional story could have a lie in it as part of the fiction. So maybe he isn't Russian, the mightiest man. In fact, I would argue. <laughs> I think there's a good chance he is. He isn't. He is not. Uh, because Russia's there's so many man. men in Russia. There's 300 million men in Russia. Right. And what, are they, and what do we mean by mighty? We got Janine Garofalo. Classic. She started freaking alternative comedy. She's still doing comedy. You can still go see her. She still has her notepad. She stills rambling. It's... She's amazing. I mean, that was great. And well, uh, I, just, I just remember at least the first couple years of it. Uh, I enjoyed a great deal when I was younger. It was... Uh, I think on Thursday night, it was like, uh, like Happy Days, uh, which got bad after. After it goes on for a while, yeah. After yeah. it goes on for a while. I would say Happy Days was great. The first season shot on film, not a live audience. Then they switched it to a live audience. I didn't like it. And they it changed as much. Arnold, too. And, and yeah. At some point, I remember. I but they, it, would, it, it, be, it starts getting worse and worse. Not that it's completely bad the whole time, but then the audience gets too crazy and. The, like with Welcome Back, Connor, it started off, I think, good, and then the catch, too many catchphrases, too much, like right, right, right. Well, oh, because each person, and, had, each person and they just said that, yeah, yeah, yeah. Goes crazy. Right, 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 right. Um, and he was a stand-up. Of uh, course, Kate Kaplan uh, was. Yeah, and he would work in the stories to Julie, his beleaguered wife, who would just, uh, like, he'd say, "Did I ever tell you about my uncle uh, Ezra?" No, Gabe. Right. And then I've got Ty Kyle Dunnigan, who, if you haven't seen him, go see him live. I'm hoping to see him this weekend. Not that it matters to you by the time you see this. I either have or haven't. I either got more or I didn't. But I saw a fucking amazing show. I know it. So, uh... Why did you pick... Well, you picked Rocky because you yeah, did... I love Rocky. I, when I was a kid, that's what got me working out. I was watching Rocky, but... I mean, it, did, it didn't work. You, uh, you go to Philly and run up the stairs or something. I Isn't there like that. a... Uh, you ever do that? Go see live comedy. And, uh... Season two will be better than season one. Uh, will it? I mean... Well, I'll be, you know, like, better at it. I think I'm getting better. I think the interview, the interviews, the interactions are better and stuff. I don't know. I think it's becoming a thing. Uh, but, I mean, some of these guests, Jesus Christ. Maybe I can get them to do them again. Maybe we've already gotten Gillis to do it the second time with the war cards. No one knows. We're here with Sherrod Smalls, just running to him on the street. On the street, hanging out, and look, he's, in my neighborhood. And he's advertising himself. White man came up to me. <laughs> I the can't jump. cards. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was some induction. What a star. You are. Oh, yeah, this I don't want to. How do I open this? Do I have to open it or can you open it? I don't have, have to. There's no have to oh, in gotcha, life. Gotcha. Gotcha. Right? That's true. Do or do not. Right. So you need to open cards! Awesome. Good. Thank Thanks, you so Dave. Much.